I think it just comes to um, guys stepping up. It's going to make a lot of opportunities for dudes like uh, Antoine Brooks, um, for Justin Lane, for James Pierre. Um, these dudes are going to have really, really good opportunities to be able to step in there and make significant, you know what I'm saying, jumps in their careers. So I think with the signing Cam Sutton, now he's going to be able to thrive. I think on the outside corner, he's a great nickel and outside. I think he was going to be able to be a starter on a lot of NFL teams regardless. So um, I think it's really good to be able to keep him. He's going to be a solid corner starter um, in the league. And then uh, just with that nickel position, figuring that out, and then just having other options with Justin Lane and um, Pierre, those dudes are really, really capable. I had to do it a couple, a, a little bit when I was like a rookie, my first two years in the league. And then, uh, I mean, it's a different ball game on the inside. You know, those are little slot receivers. The route trees are totally different. It's a whole lot of different, just timing and stuff like that. But uh, with Cam Sutton, I mean, he's been one of the, he, he just, that's what he does. You know, he's just a great inside and outside guy. Like Steve Nelson, both of those dudes. I mean, I'm more of an outside guy. Those dudes can hold that nickel spot down. I mean, I, I don't want no parts. <laughs> Honestly, I don't want no parts of the slot. But Cam is able to play both at such a high level. And uh, that's the same thing with Steve. Those two dudes are just able to go inside and outside. Um, but I think just Cam is, he's, he's, he's a Swiss Army knife. He can do a little bit of everything. But um, I think he's going to be able to strive on the outside also.